G'day Brett, JC from Adelaide Vehicle Centre. Like I said on the phone, obviously you're so far away, I thought I'd send you a quick video. Just going through, obviously, the Ford FG, giving you a bit more details about it. Um, so you just get a better description of the vehicle. But we'll get started. We've got a six-speed automatic transmission. Obviously when you're traveling around, if you're thinking about towing as well, Brett, um, you've got Triptronic transmission, so handy to put it back into gears and you can control that from here and simply up and down. Also comes up in your trip gauge as well. Uh, but as you can see just down below it, you've got a 12 volt power source as well as an auxiliary for your phone. Two cup holders here and then a dash. Another port for your phone as well. And a USB just down in underneath here as well. But uh, moving on up to the head unit here. Um, got all your functions, obviously your temperatures as well. It's built with dual climate control. So you can actually control driver side and passenger side temperature differently. So as you can see the passenger there and driver side there. So another little option they fitted with the 250 series. Um, but moving over, it's also built with the Bluetooth connectivity. Uh, obviously you're going to be traveling around, going all the way to Ayers Rock. Best thing to have Bluetooth connectivity, that way you can make inbound outbound phone calls. Obviously while you're driving and trying to dodge the kangaroos on the way. Um, but you can control that by the multifunction steering wheel. You've got all your Bluetooth options on the left here, as well as your volume. And cruise control is really easy to use on the right just there as well um, but you've got indicators on the left no sorry windscreen wipers on the left indicators and lights on the right um, your electronic windows down here as well as your mirrors over there um, but like you said on the phone you want to know what it was like underneath the dash mat I'll have a look lift it up here for you Brett mate it is really clean no scratches or tears in the dash whatsoever um, going all the way through to the driver side if you can have a look all it's got is the velcro just keeping the mat down so in really good condition there. Uh, but what we'll do, we'll jump out and have a look underneath the hood. So underneath, obviously, we've got our four litre six cylinder. Obviously with the Ford, it's got straight six instead of the V6. Um, but one thing I'll touch on for yourself, Brett, here at Adelaide Vehicle Center, we have a structural guarantee, so that means ABC we structure guarantee all our vehicles that they have never been in an accident that could affect the structure integrity of the car. And one way for yourself to have a look at that, if you have a look at the nuts and bolts underneath the bonnet, uh, it's got like paint wear, tool marks missing, you know, it's a good indication that the bonnet's been taken off and that's how you know it's been in an accident. But uh, yeah, one thing we do is our PPSR checks to make sure there's no finance on it and we chuck it through a safety mechanical just to make sure it's right for the roads as well. Uh, but we'll make our way around the vehicle. One thing I'll touch on for yourself though, Brett, um, the FG is built with a side intrusion bar. So what that is, side intrusion bar, in case of a T-bone or a side intrusion, it takes the whole force of the accident, keeping you and the occupants inside safe. It's obviously a handy thing going when you're traveling on the roads. Come to the back now. So a bit cramped in here with all the cars around. And obviously, this pops up the canopy. Pretty simple. And you think about chucking a mattress in the back of this, Brett, Fold that one down there mate, and as you can see there's plenty of room to sleep in this. It's also got a nice mat cover as well to put on so you don't actually have the tub liner bumps on the butt under there as you can see. But mate this has been hardly worked in the tub line is actually in really good condition as you can see yourself. Um, but yeah, thinking about camping and travelling all the way to Ayers Rock mate, I'll definitely see myself sleeping in the back of this. And if you think about towing, got heavy duty tow bar as well as your electric brakes fitted down the bottom there mate. Other than that, thanks for watching Brett. Um, what I'll do, I'll keep in touch with you over the phone and um, punch out some figures. But other than that, have a good day.